All right, y'all. Hey, I want to show you something um, called Playlister. Now, some of you may have heard about it, some of you may haven't, but I just want to give you a quick introduction for what it could look like and mean for Kid Life. Now, here's the deal. Um, we're already starting to implement Playlister. We're talking to all the Little Life pastors, the 412 pastors, and the Kid Life pastors. Now, here, here's my summation. When you see this, you'll understand. For Little Life, it's a no-brainer. For 412, I think it makes a lot of sense, but for Kid Life, we're a little bit more involved. Each campus takes owns a little bit more of their media and their production side. Um, so I'm not sure that this fits for Kid Life, but here's the deal. If you are a campus and you have a TV and a sound bar set up, you gotta consider this, and I'm gonna show you why. So we're a minute into this video, I've already talked too long. Playlist, or what is it? It's an app on Apple TV, but it is a media delivery system. So for you as a Kid Life pastor, this is what it would mean. No more bundles, right? No more um, downloading, preparing, making sure that's good. If if you're just following the plan, right? You got the play, put me in coach, I just wanna run it, then it would mean that you wouldn't have to worry about it. Your Apple TV while you were away, and even if you're in Mayflower or you're doing setup teardown, you would just take your Apple TV home, plug it in, it connects to your Wi-Fi, and little elves load it with the right um, stuff, right? So whenever you get in there, you would click open to Playlister. This is this week's uh, content. It's already there. It's already loaded for you. You click go, and then there's all your slides. They've already uploaded during the week. And so as my kids come in, I'm just going to start with the loop, click it. I know that right before that is my countdown video, so I'm interacting, I'm hanging out, it's time to get started. I just click the back button by tapping the back side of the remote control. Boom, 60 seconds. Now here's the cool thing. Again, if you're running it based upon a soundbar, you now, with the volume, you just click volume, and you can turn it up, right? So now it kind of removes the need for a tech person because you now have a presentation remote, volume control, all that. So again, I just click through and it brings up the next slide, click through and now it transitions into our life app, which this month we're talking about knowledge. Learn something new so you can be better at what you do. Let's keep going and move into game time. Woo, there we go. Um, and then we keep going. And so now um, we're going into worship, right? So I click in. Now here's the deal. And this is why Kid Life's a little more involved, is because we all like certain songs, certain ways to do things. And so you can customize this, right? You can make this presentation the way that you want it. Um, but again, if you just want to run two fast songs, a slow song, and you just want to kind of have it set up for you, and you want to kind of mirror what is the Kid Life statewide plan, then this is just going to show up for you. Okay, so then again, I just click through. We're gonna, this is typically gonna be set up for the video. So that now the video goes, it's automatically set to transition at the end of each video. So we click through the three videos. There. We like to set it up with kind of an altar call at the end where there's a slide with the main point with just some nice soft music. And so again, if it gets too loud for you, you can turn it down. If it's too quiet, you can turn it up with your volume or mode on your thing. But now you're just leading the kids into a time of responding to what God has done. When it's done, you have them stand up and you click into your, um, yes, man, Lisa did a version of Waymaker. It's four minutes long. We're using it because this is a phenomenal song. Um, but now you're in, and again, too quiet, you just hit volume. Take it up. Let's worship. Let's get it, right? Turn back down so you can actually hear me. Then, again, this one's also set that when it gets to the end, it's going to auto-transition, but you can click it at any time. And now we're reviewing the main point. There's the memory verse. And then we're transitioning into our small groups. If I want to show the main point, I just click the back, the left side of the thing, click it, goes to it. If I want to show the, the slide, there it is. So it kind of loops there. But the thing about it is, and I'm sorry this video went five minutes, never my intention, is that it just shows up. You just do it. You have a presentation remote. You now control the slides, the volume. It simplifies things. And you don't have to do anything. It just shows up on your Apple TV. Now, if you want to customize it, you can do that. There's a learning curve to it. But just like anything, right? So here's the deal. If you like your setup, if you like downloading the bundles, they're there. 
right? Orange provides those, so we don't have to do anything to keep giving those to you. But if this is something you want to transition to, um, it's there's a cost to it. Reach out to me. We'll talk about it. Um, but anyway, that, that kind of gives you an idea what it was.